Oh, no, Facebook is down. Anyway, I'm, I'm just kidding. Facebook, Instagram, and Threads are back online after a two-hour outage. This story is over on Engadget.com. This is just not your ordinary outage, though. This one kind of freaks some people out, especially on my timeline, because what happened was is that it started around 10 a.m., and people started reporting them on downdetector.com, but they booted you out of the login. They basically got all automatically logged out, and you couldn't sign in. So if you are anywhere familiar with any kind of security concerns, if you get booted from a site and you can't log in, your first thought will go to, oh, no, I've been hacked. Someone has hijacked my account and changed the password. That's exactly that's exactly what happens. When somebody hacks your account, you get booted and you can't log back in. So imagine the hundreds of thousands, I don't know how many people, maybe even millions of people that got that same thing all happened at the same time. Oh, no, I have been hacked. But the good news is that the WhatsApp is still working for some. Um, but uh, Facebook, Instagram, and Threads booted people to the login screen, and they could not log back in. Here's a statement that they ironically wrote on Twitter slash X. Earlier today, a technical issue caused people to have difficulty accessing some of our service uh, services. We resolved the issue as quickly as possible for everyone who was impacted, and we apologize for any convenience. Yeah, like I said, it's, it's, it's your normal outage. That's okay. You know, Twitter goes down all the time. But the fact that they got booted to log in and they couldn't log back in, I think scared a lot of people to death. And if it was me, I, I, I don't even use these apps. Like, I barely, out of all of these, I barely use Instagram. Um, I don't use Facebook at all, and I don't use Threads hardly at all anymore. But... Um, I think the last time I looked at the res, I was like curious if they added anything new, and then I then I got rid of it. Um, but I wasn't I wasn't part of this group of people that were that were logged out today because I just didn't go to the site. But man, if I was <clears throat> if I was, I would be changing my password. I'd be like, oh my goodness, I'd be trying to change my password, which probably a lot of people did. They probably tried to change their password because they thought they were hacked, um, and it probably put even more strain on the system. <laughs> this cascading effect probably was hilarious. Uh, now that it's all over during it, it probably wasn't funny, but now that it's all over, it probably was very hilarious to watch as the servers caught on fire. Check the story out over on the gadget.com. They got the details about the Facebook outage today, over two hours of outage and people were getting knocked out and their passwords didn't work. So panic set in. Am I being hacked or not? Check it out over in the gadget.